Hi Fashion TV, I'm Duffy and we're backstage at Marnie. Very simple, very organic, very basic, elementary. So for each girl, we're looking at them individually. Uh, we're working with some haircuts. We're making them slightly more graphic, just so that you have a slightly bolder silhouette. Girls with natural hair, the black girls, we're creating a stronger shape in their hair. And then the girls with the longer hair, we're just working back off of the face. So slightly squarer, but very raw. It's about creating control so that you still see this strong face, but their hair looks effortless and broken. It's all about the perfected skin and all about fresh colour. It's almost like your first application of eyeshadow. There's a real spontaneity, a real ease about the colours that we're using. Baby blue, green, pink. Very much about that early application of shadow and that fresh colour. Hi, I'm Umi and we're backstage at Marnie. I like it. Green is my favorite color, so it's good to have it on my face. Hey there, Fashion TV. This is Chanel Nesiaser at Marnie backstage. I like it this way because it's according to your skin, you know, it's so beautiful. Hi Fashion TV, this is Blesnia and we are in the backstage of Marnie. The blue eye, it's really beautiful and the natural skin, I love it. It's like natural and then this. Hi Fashion TV, I'm Matea and we are in backstage of Marnie. I always have natural makeup on shows, I like it, but also I love the other looks that other girls have, like colorful makeups and it's very good. Hi Fashion TV, we're backstage at Marnie today and stay tuned. Yeah. The makeup is really cool. It's like this smudgy colored look and very natural skin. So it's kind of like this like lived in woman. She's like slept in her eyeshadow and it's kind of very chic but very Marnie. I'm scared of God and scared of hell. Hey Fashion TV, I'm Adit Aket and we are backstage at the Marnie show. I love my makeup. It's nice and simple but it makes my skin look really good. Yeah, I do love it. <laughs> Hi, I'm Maya Wanikolasa. We are backstage at Mani. It's really nice because um, every girl has a different color, like blue and green, and it's really nice. A blue cool coat, the structure and the graphic is so nice. Like this collection is really amazing. You know, I would say elementary Watson. It's actually about elementary. I was very into this concept that brought me into thinking about a concept of a new primitivism. And so that led me to think about a techno primitivism. And so the fact that we're extremely drawn by this need for innovation and technology, and on the other hand, we can't put the movement of the soul in a technology committee. So that's a big contrast. I'm wearing a jacket and I'm wearing heels with leather stockings. It's very cool, very nice.
I'm wearing a long skirt. It's leather and it's beige and then a uh, top, really beautiful one with red in the middle and it's beige, the rest. Really nice. It brought to a sort of like techno prim and so making clothes through an elementary uh, way of thinking and making them with futuristic fabrics but also creating noble armors, battle liveries, feathers that create seductions and nudity to perdition. It was pretty much about the what's done and the undone and how that it's connected with a magnetic uh, universal attraction. And that led into this sort of exploring the sensuality of a Siamese union. So that's why you see sometimes a tube rigorous skirt with a pleated a languid skirt combined together. Or you see uh, a cat dress combined with a, a pixelated eroticism or the desire that's been combined with uh, the basics. I'm wearing a beautiful dress and it's cats on one side and another print on the other side and it's rouged in the front and all the like stitches are left exposed and I have these really interesting tights on. Then it's just like the quintessential Marnie woman. I'm wearing a green coat and it's so huge but I love it because it's so different and it's so unique. I'm wearing a jacket. It's blue with some green and green shoes, so it's beautiful. I am wearing this really pretty pink off-the-shoulder type dress. It's really elegant. I like it. show the primitive and the I and the naive and the sophisticated and the technology all meeting in a very poetic erotic way most of all what was important to me that all this uh, you know variety it's about a plurality of women women that scream out with colors and that they give a very vital message onto the street. So if it were a movie, I would have called it the I, the we, and the army of me. We all loved Consuela Castiglione, the woman who created this brand. So it was very hard, I think, for people to accept a new arrival, but Francesco is, is proving to be a great star. The raw, the metallics, the draping, the silhouette, the form, the use of felt and satin and, and, and bronze, uh, brilliant. For me it's perfect, you know, this season that Francesco is on board and he started to become uh, really into the DNA of the brand. is fantastic because it's still Marnie, 
but with the modernity of the young guy, 32 years old. So it's becoming uh, in silhouette, in fabrics, uh, in uh, trims, uh, the way that we stitch, in the style, in the accessories, uh, everything is uh, very much online and it's uh, perfect for uh, where we want to go and uh, for who we want to be, that it's still the same as before, but with the modernity of the 2020.